really beautiful so far. Really nice. Really beautiful as well. It's always something I wanted to come back. I've been waiting for years to come back to this boat and lake. Just look at it now, absolutely beautiful. Really nice. They've done lots of work to the gardens as well. There's like it's like a little shelter that they put over here as well. But yeah, absolutely beautiful, really good. And like I said, it won't be long till the boats see as well. Which I'm definitely looking forward to in the summer. But yeah, it looks really, really nice. Absolutely fantastic. Like, like I said here, you've got this little shelter over here as well where you can sit in the shade as well. Beautiful plants as well. Let's take a shot there. Yeah, what I'll do is I'll show you around the boating lake as well. We'll, we'll go around the other side as well. Mainly it's just all like you know, the plants around here as well. But yeah, really, really nice out here right now. It's absolutely nice and breezy as well because of the because of the lake being filled up as well. So yeah, here I am in the boating lake. I'm still sitting on I'm sitting on one of the benches and it looks absolutely fantastic. The boating lake does, you know. About two summers ago, I would have been standing what like over at the entrance um, and I would have found this boating lake closed but now it's open and I thought all those years ago I thought it was never going to open again and left abandoned but you know this boating lake is absolutely fantastic it's back to the way it was you know there's lots and lots of um, you know there's lots of people in here now lots of volunteers have been working extremely hard on the on the actual project itself and it looks so so good to see everything back even the lake being filled up as well which is very emotional but you know, it's back to the way it was. I'm really, really happy to see the boat and lake back again. And hopefully I'll be back in the summer going on the boats as well, which is gonna be absolutely fantastic as well. So yeah, let's continue with this beautiful walk around the boat and lake. It's a little shelter as well. I think it's called a bagola, I think. Yeah, this is a nice wooden bagola in here. This is where all the plants are. Look, more plants over here. Absolutely lovely, these plants. Really good. They've even done the pavements up here as well, which looks really good.
having a really good time in the boat and lake so far. Really beautiful, absolutely fantastic. Here I've got some little benches over here. You can see more of the pavements have been restored. Absolutely beautiful views of the lake again. It's so nice to see the, the lake actually shining in the sun, which is absolutely fantastic. You've got your ducks over here as well. I'll get a few little shots of them in a minute. But yeah, the planting in here is absolutely fantastic. They've even restored the bridge over here as well. They've done the, um, I think they're like vases as well. You can see they've got little flowers in them now. Really, really nice. Absolutely fantastic. It's beautiful because I've never been here like nearly five years, and you know it closed down, and you know lots of people were getting a bit sad because it had to close, and I thought it was never going to be opened again. But now, five years later, it's now open again. Really, really amazing to see. So I literally started following the waterways construction update like two whole years ago. I actually did like a little series of videos. If you've not seen them out, make sure you check them out. It just involved me like, you know, just following the work of the waterways, what's actually been going on and that. Like, been following it for the whole two years and it has definitely been the wait. And you know, if you've not checked those videos, please check them out. I've done a few over the last year or so. Like, I, I did, the first one I did, what the, act, the first actual construction update actually happened July last year so it involved me watching the cafe getting you know watching the cafe turn into a new one and that demolishing the old kitchen and what used to be inside and that and then I did one again in October to see the thatching on the roofs of the shelters and even the boat and lake one as well so yeah there's still there's been a lot that's changed uh, to this boat and lake and and, it, and and all the volunteers and all the people have been working in there it's absolutely been fantastic they've all done some really really good jobs to the site and like i said it's not long until the boats come please just you know check all the videos that i've done you know it's absolutely fantastic to see everyone back in here with younger generations enjoying the boat and lake and the waterways now here in the ducks look just got me these are the chicks. Yeah, these are the chicks. Wow, look at look at them little baby ducks. They look absolutely cute and really nice. Look at that really cute, really nice little little chicks that I've now grown into ducks. And these are the banal ducks by the way. I'll just zoom in a little bit on them. There they are, look. You can see the mother, the mother's chest. Yep, there's the mother, and then there's her um, her babies just there. Yeah, they are starting to um, yeah they're starting to grow up now, but yeah they look really really grown up. I remember them being really really small when I came down here a few months ago. They look really really big now, and yeah they, I think they'll go for a swim in a minute. I don't know, but yeah they look really really cute. this short vlog from Great Yarmouth Boating Lake. Uh, it's a really nice little boating lake. It's so nice to see everything back, even the planting and the, and the lake being filled up as well. So yeah, make sure you subscribe to the Brand Big Ducks YouTube channel. Make sure you actually follow the Facebook page, Instagram page, and plenty of updates on the channel. Yeah. See you in the next one very soon. Bye for now.